Hi, I'm April Golightly, and today we're going to be talking about the Gucci Blue Blossoms Small Tote. So excited. I have been wanting this bag forever. When I first saw it years ago, um, I just I just fell in love with this print. So I always thought that it was hydrangeas, but apparently according to the website, on the Gucci website, it's called geranium print. And it was a fall printed bag. It comes in with the blue flowers, the blue blossoms. And then it also has like that reddish, red orange flowers as well. To me, the blue is the best because I'm just a huge fan of blue in general. And I just love this. Also, this bag is considered reversible, but I've never seen anybody actually reverse it. So let's, let's check it out. So here it is. It's so beautiful. I actually am renting this bag uh, from this company called Vivel. Vivel. I'm gonna link it down below. It's really cool, and basically you get a bag once a month. And I'm at like the lowest tier, I think, the classic tier, and I'm able to get Gucci, Chanel, all of those types of bags, uh, Louis Vuitton. I really love it because I don't spend a ton of money on bags. And that way I get to try them out and see if I actually use them rather than buying them and spending thousands on them and actually never getting to actually using them. Well, I have to tell you that I'm a huge fan of this bag. So this is the small tote. My friend actually has the large tote. I'm going to throw the clip in here for the large tote. Um, but this is the small one and I really, really love it. So today we're going to be talking about the size of it the leather, the details, and what fits inside. Also, what it matches. Like, can we actually find outfits in our closet to match this bag? Let's get started. So this bag is actually 11 inches, 11 inches across by nine, four inches deep here, which means if you guys know about a piece of paper, it's eight and a half by 11, meaning that you could actually put a notebook that's eight and a half by 11 inside this. So obviously some notebooks are a little bit oversized. So if it's too oversized, it's probably not gonna fit in this. But if you wanna carry some sort of pad of paper, you could actually fit this, fit it in here, which is awesome. So even though it's a tinier bag, it's pretty small, you can actually use it for as a work bag. So with this, this is also, let me see, the drop on the handles are seven and a half inches. Here we go. It's actually leather, which is really nice and not a canvas. It's a leather printed and the handles and the interior are navy blue. So it's very subtle, very, very dark navy blue, like a dark blue, like maybe a midnight, not even a navy. Like I'm wearing a black jacket right now and I don't think it looks that obvious that it's a navy. So it's one of those subtle, dark, really dark, dark blues. So this bag also comes with this cute little luggage tag that says Gucci on it. It's very, very cute. Let me open it for you guys. Careful. There. You can add your name and your information and just slide it in there. It's really nice, beautiful leather Gucci, made in Italy. You can check that out there. It can fit a ton of stuff. Let's talk about what fits in this amazing bag. So I have in here, I mean, right now it's not very full, so it could definitely fit a lot more than what I'm actually fitting in it at this moment. So let's just talk about what actually fits in it. So I have this water bottle here, and I think this is... I'll link this down below if I can find it, but it's a it's a normal size water bottle, um, glass. I think I got this from what is that Fit Fab Fun box thing um, a couple years ago. I actually have two of them. Someone gave one, one of them to me as a gift because I absolutely loved it. Um, a hair clip, put my hair up. It's hot summer here. Uh, my hand sanitizer that I get from uh, Bath and Body Works. Um, my little wallet that I use that I keep my cards in and this one's from Stony Clover Lane with my initials on it um, I have a little band-aid keychain thing that I keep my band-aids in because I have been getting a lot of blisters lately and I definitely need my band-aids um, a thing of lip gloss uh, that's what I'm actually wearing at the moment 
I'm probably going to butcher this, guys. Uh, this is Marajuka Juicy Lip Plump from Tarte. It's really nice, pretty color. And the color is Primrose. I've been wearing it a while, so if it's like rubbed off, I feel like it's not like glossy at the moment, but it goes on really glossy, and this is kind of like the remnants of it. Um, also, I have my little heart keychain, whatever, coin purse thing. Do you guys want to know what's in this? I don't know. Um, I love these from Sony Quarter Lane. I have my key, uh, my little pill case thing, emergency allergy pills, basically. Um, another lip gloss. This is if I'm like really, really chapped. And then a little skin treat by Tarte. Uh, this one is like an emergency if I get like, I'm allergic to dairy. So if I get like a pimple that pops up, I just want to hide it with this. Here's another few things that you can actually fit into this bag. So I have my planner here. Uh, so this is kind of like a notebook planner. It's pretty big. This is the large one from Happy Planner. And that fits in there. Let me show you. It's popping out the top a little bit, but the width of it fits in perfectly, which is really cool. And then I have my small pouch from Sony Clover Lane. This one's the Barbie one. This one's kind of the old uh, edition of the Barbie collection. Um, and yeah, that's the small one. It fits both this way and this way. And then, so in right now, I also have my water bottle in there. It's really cool that it fits, yay! I absolutely love doing these videos where I'm reviewing like designer bags or contemporary bags. If you guys like this type of content, let me know in the comments down below. And also, I wanted to give you guys my secret password. So in this case, it's Gucci Blue Blooms. Comment that down below so I know that you've gotten this far in my video. So I found this one actually online for like about a thousand dollars. I mean like don't quote me at this moment because of course like you know if it gets super popular again it might go up or it might go down depending on quality also. Um, but it's a fully leather bag and for a thousand dollar Gucci bag and it's very much like this is the Gucci bag and it's a very popular print. So I would say a thousand dollars for like a Gucci tote that you can both wear regularly and then wear to work as well by like using it for notebooks. I think it's amazing and I think it's a great deal. So I'm going to link them down below. Hopefully there's a few still available, um, but I'm a huge fan. So for example, right now I was just looking on the Gucci website and they had like a Jackie available that it's like full leather, like small tote. And that tote is going for 4,500. So to get a Gucci bag for a leather tote bag for like a thousand dollars is amazing and a great deal. And obviously if you want to try it out on Vivelle beforehand, you can too. Um, also this one comes, I think in this print comes in a ton of different things, mostly on the aftermarket because I don't think the print is available anymore anyway. But they also have a large tote version, which would be amazing as well. I feel like as a petite woman, it's nice to have like a smaller tote so that the big totes don't like overwhelm your whole body. That way, in comparison, you know, the tote bag kind of makes you look smaller in comparison. Just my thought process. Um, so I try not to go crazy with like that large bag trend that goes on. So I go for something that's a little bit smaller, but also fits everything that I need. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been super fun. I hope you love these videos. Let me know in the comments down below if you love this bag and if you want me to do more videos like this.